Good evening. <laughs> Happy birthday. Am I blowing this out? Go on then. <laughs> we have cake. We have cake, but not to be eaten until mm. later. What do you think of those photos, eh? Pretty good. And we've got champagne courtesy of Mike Risto. Thank you, Mike, if you're on there. There. And we have got a, um, at least one more photo which came in after I'd rendered the video. Sorry, Gail and Helen. But the rest of you, send me, send me your photos. Oh, typical, we've got a bottle that we can't oh, open. Go, oh, no, go. it's coming, it's, it's coming, it's away. coming. Yay! Boom! <laughs> Tell you what, this jacket's not staying on for much longer, it's warm in here. I've had a right mess of that, you have, haven't I? Yeah. Oh. I'm used to this. Happy Hang anniversary on. everybody. Or well, happy birthday to that to us and the bears and everything else. Hang on. Make it worthwhile, dear. I will. There we go. That's fine, thank you. We will do some songs. Oh, bugger that. <laughs> We've got champagne. Whoa! We've got cake. I've got a mess on the carpet. Um, oh, my phone's still switched on. Uh, well, cheers, folks. We wasn't expecting this. Never oh, dreamt no. this would be going on for a year. There we are. It's sorted. Switched off, yeah. And uh, let's hope we don't make hope we don't make a second one, eh? Yeah, God, fifty-three weeks without a break, hmm. and we thought. You know, go on. I did. I wrote. I wrote all this down. Just thinking about it. Excuse me. Two hundred and two original songs performed. Two hundred and thirty-eight. I think that is or two hundred and thirty-six covers. Uh, if you want to add that two together, that's why well, um, four hundred and thirty-eight songs. Before tonight, if somebody would like to check that, off you go. We'd better crack on and do some songs anyway. Yeah, I was going to say, when you say somebody would like to check that, I'm sure there's a few out there who know. Oh, they're, they're probably, I'll, I'll more than likely stand to be corrected. So we've got some requests of yeah. songs that people wanted. We've got a couple that we just wanted to do. And somebody suggested that we should start with the very first song that we did. It was Ted. Very first Thank night. You, Ted. It was Ted. It so. was Ted, yeah. And so if you think back a year... I've got my arm in a sling. I was wearing tracky bottoms in your shirt, I think. Quite possible. And we sang this song. Uh, which it seemed, yeah, it seemed very appropriate because we just got into lockdown. Stephen Stills' song. When you're down.
Well, you did have a choice. Can I just say, oh, right, um, if Susie's <coughs> on there, Susie will be wondering why I am wearing this dress. Right. Because Susie phoned up earlier, like FaceTime, while I was getting dressed. So she saw the dress I put on. I put on a very nice dress, which Dave bought me for Christmas a couple of years ago. I did, I yeah, I did. It's a very, very nice dress. dress. Very and nice I came dress. downstairs and he said, aren't you getting dolled up? <laughs> I thought it was, you know, a special night. I've got to put my suit on for crying out loud. <laughs> I was gutted. So, no, 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 that, that looks lovely, though. <laughs> the, the other one looked nice. I mean, I bought you the damn thing. Keep digging, boy, keep digging. We ain't never going to make another year at this rate. <laughs> <laughs> tell you now. <laughs> uh, yeah, we've got some... Uh, I just I see um, Lynn was on there as well. Happy birthday, Lynn. Oh, yeah, and, happy um, birthday, Lynn. Today? Yeah, Rochelle. I noticed Rochelle was on there as well while we were singing away there. And oh. um, cheers to all in New Zealand. I'm not yes. having many tonight, Rochelle. <laughs> <laughs> yes, here's I, to everybody I, I, down there. Every, every time I mention Rochelle's name, I get a hangover. Um, I did see that, is it Brisbane has gone into a three day lockdown again at the moment? Oh, keep it cheerful. Yeah. Uh, who else have we got? Oh, John Melbourne. So we've got Spain on. We've got. Sweden on, Sweden. Bingo, got the right country. Oh, brilliant. Uh, Sharon, Cat, Whoop, Martin's doing his whoop whoops. Martin is on, that's Denmark, I think. Oh, we're getting through a few here. No, Sheila, diplomacy isn't your strong point, it's is it? It's never been a strong point, Sheila. No. no. Oh, Vivi's on. Oh, right. Yes, we'll crack on. This, um, this is a, a Richard Thompson song, surprisingly enough. Uh, and it was requested by Sheila Hanley. Sheila Hanley, yeah. Sheila and it's on. It's on the thing, but I can't see it. No, I can't. Uh, <laughs> Sheila and Mike. Sheila and Mike. This is for you. It's Bees Wing. All being well. I was nineteen when I came to town. They called it the summer of love Burning babies, burning flags The hearts against the doves I took a job at the steamy Down on Cauldron Street I fell in love with a laundry girl Who was working next to me She was a red thing Fine as a bee's wing so fine a breath of wind might blow her away She was a lost child But she was running wild She said as long as there's no price on her I'll stay And you wouldn't want me any other way Round her face and a look of half surprise, like a fox caught in the headlights. There was animal in her eyes. She said, Young man, oh, can't you see I'm not the factory kind? If you don't take me out of here, I'll surely lose my mind. She was a rare thing, fine as a bee's wing. So fine that I might crush you where she lay She was a lost child But she was running wild She said as long as there's no price on the love I'll stay And you wouldn't want me any other way We passed around the market towns We picked fruit down in Kent we could tinkle lamps and pots and knives wherever we went And I thought that we might settle down Get a few acres done Fire burning in the heart and babies on the run She said, young man, a foolish man That surely sounds like hell You might be lord of half the world You're not old as well She was a red thing 
turns the bees wind So fine a breath of wind But blown away She was a lost child But she was running wild She said as long as there's no price On my past day And she wouldn't want me any We were camping down the gal one time The work was pretty good She thought we shouldn't wait for the frost And I thought maybe we should We were drinking more in those days And tempers reached a pitch Like a fool I let her run with a rambling inch And the last I heard she's sleeping rough She's back on the derby beat White horse in her hip pocket And a wolf found at her feet And they say she even married once A man named Romany Brown But even a gypsy caravan Was too much settling down She was a red thing Fires of bees wind So fine a breath of wind might blow away She was a lost child Well, she was running wild She said as long as there's no price on the love I stay And she wouldn't want me any other way And they say a flower is faded now Hard weather and hard blue Maybe that's just the price you pay For the change that you refuse She was a rare thing Fighting as a bee's wing And I'm missing more than ever words could say If I could just taste all of the wildness now If I could hold her in my arms today And I wouldn't want her any other way You were sweating. I got lost halfway through there. Did you? Mm, I was meant to be a solo in the middle of that, I forgot where it went. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey ho! It's beautiful, beautiful, beautiful song, song. isn't it? Just, yeah. It's no good. <laughs> it's coming off, I've isn't done, it? Come on, I've done two songs. Not done bad. The jacket's coming off Oh, bless. Off well. Paul Bailey, that's the best he's heard that song. Oh, thank you, Paul. That's really nice, yeah. Um, it's just that? a, it's a stunning song and um, I do think you do it very well. It's a beautiful song, isn't it? I always say, um, I sometimes do uh, songwriting workshops at festivals. What that was. Was that your it's my tie, tie flying like? across the room. All oh, right, okay. And um, I always say, if you can get a, get at least one killer line in a song, and um, Thompson's just downright greedy. He's got loads in there. He's got so, so many really brilliant songs. But you just, you know, that maybe that's just the price you pay for the change you refuse. That's. But also, yeah. in terms of picture, you know, creating a picture with words. Last I heard, she was sleeping rough, back, back on the Derby, on the Derby beat. beat. Yeah. White horse in her hip pocket and a wolfhound at her feet. You can see her, you know, it's just, yeah. thought that it's we amazing. Might, thought that we might settle down, get a few acres dug, fire burning in the hearth and babies on the rug. Oh, <coughs> talking to babies on the rug. We've got another one on the way tomorrow. Be another one, another one come the end of the weekend. Not personally, that is um, just that. Yeah. Um, no, uh, yeah, we're uh, Our good luck, Ali, for tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Yeah, well, uh, more more calls for celebration. Yes, like we need any more. So that'll be, we'll be in double figures. We'll have ten grandchildren after we this will. weekend. Yeah. And with luck, they'll stop then. You never know. <clears throat> now, this song, this was a song that we didn't know 
before. I, I think I had heard it before, but we'd, we'd certainly never done it before we started doing the, uh, these streams. And it was requested by Richard Fleming. And it's an Alistair Hewlett song. Sadly, Alistair Hewlett no longer with us. Um, and it tells the story of the, the Whitnew Mines, um, which were uh, mineral mines in northern Australia, um, where many, many men were severe. The jacket's coming off now. The jacket's coming off. Men went to work. Could you hold that for and, me, Lord? Um, Thank you. Excuse me, folks. Many of them then got lung disease and basically died and struggled to get compensation. And so this song is, um, it's just, it's beautiful. It's called... Uh, it's for Richard. Word. Yeah. I said that. Did you say that? Sorry, I wasn't <clears> Excuse me, I'm just going to get another cup. I'm going to so have a frog um, in my throat. <coughs> As it's our anniversary, <coughs> we're keeping it cheerful. Yeah. <coughs> oh dear. Oh, yeah, food, right. food and coffee, yeah. Oh, God, that's a hell of a combination, isn't it? It's not nice. It was lovely fizz, Mike, but. There's a man. It's 
brilliant song. Fantastic piece of writing. It is. Um, if you go on YouTube and look up Kate Fagan. Cheers. Kate singing that song. She is the sister of James Fagan, of Nancy Kerr and James Fagan fame. Um, and she does a, a beautiful, beautiful version of that song. Um, it is introduced by Martin Pearson, who oh, is a, a very, <laughs> very straight boy. He's, he's he is wonderful. He's a good lad. Extre yeah. um, lovely bloke, great company, extremely funny, very political, yeah. and quite um, says shocking. It, says it how it is. He does. To be fair, yeah. Yes. Yeah, um, if, if there's anybody new on there, see we're up to um, we're up to 84 watches, which is unusual. That's brilliant, thank you. <laughs> which is great. Thanks for being there. Um, what we normally do, we normally do covers one week, and then we do um, originals the following week. And the, the last few weeks of originals, we've been featuring certain albums, working our way through our albums. I think we're on album number five, number six. I think is next. Yes. And, and that's how we usually do it, alternate weeks. So let us know where you're from, mm -hmm. that's all good. But we have got a change coming. There's a change going to come. Change going to come. Next week. Um, we're having a rest. We're having a rest. What we not. No. Um, <laughs> we've been doing this every week for a year, hence the celebration tonight, uh, without a break. And that's not, not like that's hard work. That's not, not to say we've been working hard, we haven't. It's not, not difficult. Um, but uh, over the year, we have turned down a number of, uh, I wouldn't say lucrative, but uh, a number of paying gigs to keep doing this. And people do donate, so we do appreciate that. But um, we said once we'd done a year, if we got the offer of any uh, gigs, we would take them. And next week, by way of a busman's holiday, we're not doing this. We're doing a gig. And it would be great if you would join us. Um, it's Poppleton Live. Poppleton Live, yeah. John Watson, the, his crew. The guy who books it is the guy who books for the Costa del Folk uh, festivals. Yes, and so we'd like to make a good impression. We would very, very much like to make a good impression on him um, because there's quite a few of the regulars at the Costa have been saying to him, oh, why don't you book Winter Wilson? And he's always said, oh, we'll, we'll definitely do something, we'll but he never has. Yet. So, yet. Um, but it is a paying gig. So, if you were thinking of donating tonight and would like to use that money to buy a ticket, ticket for next, next week, week instead, we would appreciate we it. We would seriously appreciate it. There is a, a mention of it at the top. It's poppletonlive.co.uk, but go, we will also create an event. If you go to the top of the stream, there is a link there for the tickets. And we would love... It's on Zoom, so, you know, you can... You, we can see you as well as you seeing us, mm. um, but it would be it would be lovely if if some of you would join us there next week and um, help make a good impression on Mr. Yeah. Watson. And if you can't get next week, we'll be back in a fortnight. Yes. But anyway, moving on, we've got to crack on. Yeah, got a lot to get through. Ah. Um, we're doing this just because we love it, and we'll dedicate this to Manel because I know he likes a bit of oh, blues. Oh yeah, he's Manel. a bit of a bit of a blues man. Bring it home to me. Write it on a 
piece of paper so it can be read to me. Tell me that you love me. Stop driving me mad because I need. you give it up, bring it home to me, write it on a piece of paper so it can be read to me, tell me that you love me, stop driving me mad, because I Little Willie John. I don't know why Peter Green never claimed it, but he no, uh, he, he certainly did. made it very popular. Did. Brilliant yeah. version, Peter Green. Well, Fleetwood Mac with Peter Green. Yeah, yeah. Mm. cracker. And uh, oh yeah, this this <laughs> this next one. Well, what's been really good about the last year is the uh, the requests people have sent in. When we say good. Um, <laughs> From the sublime to the ridiculous, and I didn't know this song at all, but um, for some reason it touched me. Hang on a minute, I've got to get a banjo. Oh dear. Uh, yeah, so oh, this is Ferrari, we've got more different instruments, and uh, yes, yeah, so for some reason this song touched Dave, so this is definitely on the ridiculous end of the sublime <laughs> to ridiculous scale. But I love it, I just think it's great. And, uh, Please don't play it too fast. We're doing this for Sheila, um, because it was Sheila who originally suggested it. Sheila Sibbons. Yeah, she was yeah. Sure. There's conversations going on about how everybody's wardrobes have shrunk since last year. Do you oh, know, yeah. I got a real surprise, because when he told me that I wasn't dolled up in, a, in the other dress, I went to put this one on, <laughs> which I haven't worn since last summer. And not only does it fit, but it actually is a little bit looser than it was then. And it's not that I've lost weight. I think it's just all the exercise yeah. I've been doing that I've lost a little bit of flab. It's, it's great to see all the beautiful comments about the music. I just glanced down and saw it. Ele Elastic waistband PJs. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Uh, well, yeah, yes, yeah. To be fair, we all live in them, don't Indeed. we? Indeed. This, uh, I've, I've, I'm not on beer tonight, obviously, because I'm on champagne. Thank you, Mike. Oh, Mike, I meant to phone you back. I just I realised I got a missed call from you yesterday. Sorry. Mike Wistow. Mike Wistow, oh, yeah. right, yeah, sorry. Um, but um, while we're on, we mentioned about Sheila and this next song, this is thanks to Sheila and Ted. Got two bottles of this. They, they pop round today with a card and uh, two bottles of bourbon barrel scotch ale. So I shall um, I might have to help save you with them. That one. This was, uh, um, well, Dave, to be fair, there's not been a lot of um, music and playing going on this week, has there, or the last 10 days, because not only has he 
de decorated the whole of the horse stairs and landing, um, but is now the last couple of days sanded, filled, resanded, refilled, and resanded all the parquet flooring in the um, in the hall. And it's like the house was built in 1926, and I think they found the parquet here before they built it. Uh, quite frankly, did, yeah. But anyway, <laughs> so, uh, anyway, yeah, this is a um... Hank Williams. No, it's no, Williams. it's the Incredible String Band. That's right. <laughs> This one, yeah. Graham oh, and thanks. Uh, did we mention the photos, by Oh, way? yes, thank you. I thank did. You. Well, I did. But yes, thank yeah. you to everybody who sent us photos already. Anybody else, send us your party photos from tonight. Please do. And we will do something with them. I haven't thought what yet. But um, Naughty Ted was very was very happy to introduce everybody tonight. <laughs> I don't know why. If that's Naughty Ted and the one with the shades is cool Ted. Don't know why. I don't, I don't collect teddy bears. I've just been given those two. And I don't know why. But there we are. You see, we're not done teddy bear, we should do that. I ah. just wanna be your teddy bear. That's not. No. Uh, what are Can we I doing? Can I have some more fists, please? Yeah, I guess so, yeah. I guess so. I hope <laughs> you're all having a having a little tipple. Well, yeah, I, know, I, I know some of you oh, are. Oh, yeah. Well, you, you've got to do to get through this, haven't you? Let's be honest. Let's face it, yeah. Oh, no, you did it. Now, um, oh, with oh, regard to the... Um, the Life and the Lounge in the Flesh get together. We are working on it. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah. I had a couple of other ideas. Um, we will probably Not move it into Sleaford um, because uh, there's plenty of accommodation around if people want to travel and if people want to come in camper vans 
there are several of us who will lend drives, or if yeah. by then we're allowed to have people stay in houses, who knows? We'll see what happens. We'll, we'll yeah. see what happens. Anyway, yeah. Well, this I'm guessing song, you must be able to have folks in houses, or we'll be able to have folks in into a gig. This is true. So, um, so yeah, this song was. Um, so as oh, I say, yeah. Graham Pettifer requested it, and this song is responsible for one of the most terrifying moments of my entire life. Um, go Rich, on. Richard Harvey, that's a good idea. We could call it the Teddy Bears Picnic. We, we <laughs> could <laughs> call it Life like on the Lounge Teddy Bears Yeah, the Teddy Bears Picnic, picnic. brilliant. Uh, so, oh God, yeah. Lynette and Faz have finished their bottle of fizz. Well, you just have to send him for another one, love. I'm sure you'll manage <laughs> Uh, yeah. yeah, come on, crack on. We've yes. got loads of songs here. We've not <laughs> this song was, um, yeah, I had to walk out on stage in front of, as I've said on several occasions, about 16,000 umbrellas um, and play this, sing well, this you song. You it, mate. You had the easy job. I had all those chords to play. And it wasn't in my key. Anyway. And I was scared. But I did get a pint glass of red wine afterwards from the uh, stage manager, which was quite nice. Mm. Uh, we'll dedicate this to Georgia. I don't know if she's on there. Um, yeah. I know sometimes she's there, but uh, this is written by her mum, Sandy Denny. Champagne and singing, you see. Yeah. <laughs> it sticks a bit. And I, and I, I need whiskey, you see. That's what it is. Did we wish Irene a happy birthday? We didn't. So tomorrow is happy birthday to Irene Marshall, seen earlier on with Teddy Bear. Indeed. And also to Murray Gross out there Murray. in Saskatoon, Saskatchewan. Yeah. And Murray has sent a request through. I've been working on it, Murray. Um, a couple of weeks, mate. We'll, yeah. <laughs> 
we, we, we will do it. Yeah, I don't know. I'm, I'm not promising what it's going to be like, but I never do, to be fair. But yeah. Yeah. Um, the last time we did that song on these sessions, um, I started the flute solo in completely the wrong key. This time I did most of it in the right key, but not all of it. Uh, ah. Oh, now. this is for Martin and Sharon. It is. Now, we did this song just a few weeks ago. It's another Stephen Stills song. Well, I think it is Stephen Stills, yeah. It is, it says yeah, so, yeah. Oh, well, that might be the, that be the one then. Well done. But, it's Crosby Stills, isn't that? Yeah, you we know, did it not very long ago, but it was when Sharon was in hospital, and Sharon is now at home, as you all know, and recovering, but has now got a poorly leg. <laughs> what are you laughing I'm at sorry, now? sorry, I just... I, I glanced down at my iPad and just see random comments, and you know, I just saw one there from Janet Creswell. It's hard to concentrate when the cats are licking my toes. <laughs> <laughs> what are you? What have you been putting on your toes, Janet? Catnip, <laughs> yee. <laughs> um, okay. Uh, oh, it's also Francis Vernon's Francis. birthday tomorrow down in Horsham. Happy birthday, Happy Francis! Happy birthday to you tomorrow yeah, as well, yeah, Francis. Brilliant stuff. Yeah. Um, is all these people who just managed to miss April Fool's Day. Dougie Bristow, happy birthday, Doug. I know he won't be watching this. He's 89 today, but I used to work with him. Good lad. And also, the 2nd of April is the anniversary of your dad popping his clothes. I mean, died, you know, yeah. of all the people, you would have thought that he would have done it on April Fool's Day. Well, he never, never had a great time, and he missed that one as well. <laughs> anyway, yes. Yeah, he so never this missed is... last orders, bless him. No. <laughs> Yeah. For any, Martin and Sharon. Any excuse to sing this, I love this. It's great. I cannot think how it starts. No. Champagne, you say? Helplessly It's a lovely song to sing. It's um, <clears throat> it's one of them where, as I, I, I said before, <laughs> I think, when we did it, that I'm sure they've been taking noxious substances when, well, when he wrote it. You had to then, it was the 60s, eh? Hey? You, you never know, get through that, the 60s. Oh, let's do a song that's all alliteration rather Ooh. than rhyme, although there are oh, some, some rhymes in it as well. Yeah, there but are. it's very, very clever. Yeah. And now, this... There's a the thing, just talking about brilliant songs. 
And you, just, you know, you're mentioning that. We, we've not done this, and we're not going to do it. We, we might do it another week, but it's just come to mind. Paul Simon, brilliant songwriter. I know we have done some of his songs over the over the past year. We certainly did Duncan. Mm. And um, but uh, America, the song America. And it's what is absolute genius about that song. There's not a single rhyme anywhere through it, and you'd never. You'd, you'd, it's it's not glaringly obvious. It doesn't jar at all. It doesn't. Does it? Normally, if, if you hear a, a, a song with you know where there's there's like a, a rhyme where you think there should be a rhyme, normally it would stick out like a sore thumb. With that song, it just flows beautifully. Anyway, moving Talking on. Talking of songs that flow beautifully, this one is for Sarah. Um, oh. with whom I will be dragging myself around the streets tomorrow morning. She does this. Makes a few quid as well. She's quite good. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be, uh, yeah, going running in the morning. Yeah. Um, and this is, it's a song, it's one of those songs that I didn't really like when it was requested. Um, I'm trying to remember who it was that requested it in the first place, and I can't. But... Then I listened to Bonnie Raitt doing it. I'll tell it. you, Angela. Thanks, Angela, oh, it was Angela and David. And David. Yeah. Thanks That's for the right. card, by yes. the way, today, and the donation. Very much appreciated. But it was Angela who requested it. Was. It was. And yeah. then I listened to Bonnie Raitt singing it. And I listened to Randy Newman, who wrote it, singing it as well. And I absolutely bloody love it now. I love Randy Newman and all. Is it, he's, is it, he's playing is it, in the UK next year. Is he? Yeah, yeah. Oh, that'd be worth seeing. Oh, yeah, damn that. I'll go for that. Yeah. Uh, it's an acquired taste, not the not the greatest singing voice you've ever heard. But, but then Dylan, write. Richard Thompson, Neil Young, Neil you know, Young, just a, a fantastic a wordsmith. Brilliant way with the song. Yeah. Anyway, yeah. this is um, yeah, this is for Sarah. Yeah. 
If you knew how happy you are making me, I never thought I'd love anyone so much. Feels like home to me. Feels like. <laughs> I like mm, I good song. Now we're just going to do a couple more. Yep. Um, this one was a late edition, wasn't it? It actually? was. Yeah. We just thought we had to. But um, before we do, can we just say thank you so much? Oh yeah. For sticking with us for last year, for helping keeping us sane. Well, relatively reasonably. Think what think what we would have been like without you. I tell you. Um. Yeah. Remind you again that next week we won't be on here, but we will be live on Poppleton Live. It is a ticketed event. If you feel that you can, please do. We would appreciate we your would support. We would massively appreciate your support. If, so, if, um, if we can sort of show John that we've got a level of support, we might get booked to go out to the Costa del Fe. Be well. point, which would be lovely. That would be great. Um, and also, obviously, <laughs> thank you so much for your donations as well. We have cracked the £3,000. Yeah, we did say last week we, we were hoping to crack it by the end of tonight. Well, bless your hearts, we cracked it by the end of last week. So, yeah, um, so yeah. the um, the food bank and the uh, Musicians' Union Hardship Fund have had more than £1,500 each, which is fantastic. And on top of that, there was over £300 that went to the Mick Peat Bursary at Drystone Arts. So I've you've been incredibly that. generous. You are, and yeah. Um, I don't know what we'd have done without you, quite frankly, for the last year. It would have yep. been a bit a bit worse than it has been. But, uh, we're not going anywhere. No, we're not going yeah, anywhere. And we'd love, as I we say, we'd love to see you next week. It would be great. Um, yeah, we'll do a couple more. This one, it was Steve Doan who it requested was. this. And, um, and it's, a great, it's a, a great song, but I just never ever thought I would sing a Lady Gaga song. Or Lady Ha Ha, as it Lady was. Lady Ha Ha, as it was when Steve said it, yeah. Uh, Auto correct sure. went nuts. And uh, we, we, we thought yesterday, we were thinking about this, believe it or not, and thinking about the extremes that things have gone to. So we've sort of, I was saying it was amazing that we've gone from the incredible string band to Lady Gaga. And so we, we thought, as, as a last minute addition, we'd, we'd pop this one in, and then uh, we'll do one more after that, and then uh, cake. And then we'll eat cake. Mm. I'll finish the face. There you are. <laughs> That's gone well. No, not really. So I thought I'd tune it. That's still right. You've got a tuner on there, look. They're for wimps. Times I find myself longing for 
changed In the bad times I feel myself Tell me something, boy Aren't you tired trying to fill that void? Or do you need more? Ain't it hard keeping it so hardcore I'm falling In all the good times I find In the bad times I fear myself I'm off the deep end Watch as I dive in And I never reach the ground Crash to the surface Where they can hurt us We're far from the shallow now Show us your Bugging it up first time, that was a fact. Yeah, oh, it was yeah, close. Yeah. It was close. Yeah. It's a, I tell you, have you seen the film? Oh. I don't know why I'm saying like you're going to answer me, but the film, um, A Star Is Born, born. Um, obviously a remake of a remake. I remember it, it was Chris Christopherson and Barbara Streisand. It was. Before that was. It was Judy Garland and somebody else. I can't remember, but I know it goes way back. Yeah. But um, who was the guy who was singing in it? Bradley Shaw. No, Bradley somebody. See, I thought Bradley Wiggins there, but it's a cyclist. <laughs> it's not Bradley Wiggins. Bradley yeah, somebody. But, but if you've not seen it, it's well worth seeing. It was one of them, we were on a flight somewhere. and uh, It was I, somewhere I, to or from or across Canada. I think it was, it was, you're right, it was Canada. And you know, you just sort of think, we've got about five hours on a plane, bang the headphones on, watch a film, or half a dozen films. And um, that was on, so I thought, oh, I'll watch it. I would have never gone to the cinema to watch it, I've got to be honest with you, um, more fool me, um, but it was brilliant, really good film. Really it was, I, I cried, there you go. And she Gale, can just sing. saying, um, it's actually a good film, I was surprised. Yeah. Uh, James Mason apparently was in the one with Judy Garland, you see, well, somebody always knows, always thank somebody you. There, yeah. Who was that, that was Kathy Runswick. Thank you um, Kathy. Um, Bradley Cooper, thank you Sarah. Bradley Cooper. I knew it was Bradley somebody. Yeah. Um, no, it's a it's a, a really good really good film. Well worth watching. Oh, Murray's just arrived. Happy birthday for tomorrow, Murray. Happy birthday, we didn't Murray. say that earlier, but you weren't listening. Yeah. Um. So yes, uh, as we've said earlier, next week we won't be live on here, but we will be live on Pompleton Live. If you can bring yourselves to buy tickets for that, would be fantastic. We would appreciate it. Um. Otherwise, uh, donations as normal. Um. Oh, Lee. Leanne's on there. She sobbed as well. Oh, Leanna, bless her. Yeah. yeah. How are you doing, sweet pea? Um, and then, is that it? Is that I said everything? I think you have, yeah. I think so. Yeah. Thank you again, everybody. It's Thanks for being there. What a year, hey? Hey. We'll leave you with this. Um, 
But I just love the song. And as the uh, as the clocks have changed and we're now into British summertime, we just thought this was appropriate. It's George Harrison. Song. Kay's asking, is it the same time next week? I, <coughs> is it about seven thirty? It if, is seven thirty because we started watching the Steve Knight one. We did. Yeah, it's uh, yeah. It does. It starts, it starts at seven thirty. Kay. Yeah. Uh, if you go on to say, there's a link on the top of this stream. There's a link there to Popperton Live. All the details are on that. But we'll once we're finished here, we'll get into some cake and create a um, what do you call an event, it? An for, event next week. for next and, week. And um, yeah, please let us have your photos of you uh, joining us tonight. That would be great, and we'll uh, yeah, we'll, we'll get, get up, those up we'll there. get them up there as well. And uh, just as the the clocks have gone forward, we've had a couple of days of night weather. It was bloody freezing today, mind. But and. We're all looking forward with a little bit more optimism. Um, uh, Leanne's had her second injection this week. We've both had our first. We know loads of you have as well. And uh, It's that kind of age group, isn't it? it is. <laughs> yeah, when did we start being friends with old people? I have no idea. Yeah. But, anyway. um, but it's just, this is a, a song that kind of sums all of that up. Yeah. And, and uh, um, I hope to see you next week. We and will, failing that, we will be back we'll here be back in here two in weeks' time. Everybody. Cheers, everybody. Thank you. Bye Thank bye. you. See you soon.